Discuss group. Here for all your CD, DVD and Blu-ray printing needs. At the start of the replication line is a hopper filled with polycarbonate beads. This hopper ensures a continuous supply to the injection barrel. The sensor tells the hopper when to feed more polycarbonate into the machine. The polycarbonate is melted in chambers at 300 degrees. It can now be injected into the moulds to produce discs. Each disc takes around 5 seconds to mould and is created under a force of 25 tonnes. Here you can see the content on the stamper being added to make the disc. The disc is now ready to have a metal coating applied. The metal allows the disc to be read by a disc player. A robotic arm puts the discs onto the conveyor. At the end, a thin coating of aluminium is applied to the disc. It takes one second to cure. Here is where the aluminium is applied inside the mould. The process is totally automated to ensure maximum production capability. Here you can see the disc stamper mounted in the moulding chamber. Each machine can produce up to 35,000 discs a day. The surface is protected by applying a clear lacquer. And ultraviolet lamps cure it onto the disc. It also allows ink to stick to it. Considering a disc replication project, Discus Group will be pleased to talk to you. We ship worldwide from our three European locations. Now watch our short film on offset lithoprinting.